hey guys we just got to the graduation center right now and um, we're waiting for them to start and everything so you see we'll get back to you <laughs> Anina, I wish you congratulations for on your graduation and success. Anyways, I want to ask you how your medical school experience was like in one word. You watch the camera. Awesome. What was the most challenging thing for you throughout your six years in medical school? I think it was like third year. Wow. It was a lot like pharmacology, yeah. A lot of family for pharmacology. We have pharmacology, yeah. It was a lot of families to do. And oh my god, you bad. Oh my god, yes, yes. Wow, but you see, you overcome everything. So, what was your easiest, like your smoothest moment? So that all these COVID 19 patients will not come. <laughs> you will not see me first. Amen. You got the other people. Success, good luck. You know your endeavors. And keep shining. Congratulations on your graduation. So, firstly, I want to ask you how much you love it for you in one word. In one word. Feeling. It's like you're really excited to be graduating today. Uh, From day one, actually, I came into medical school with so much excitement and the desire to pursue my long life dream. So I think every moment of it was really exciting. I don't think I really had any difficult, you know, uh, moment in particular. But I remember in anatomy one time in first year, I cried after the class because I, I just thought that it was a lot to take on my work. Outside of that, all of it was. Yes, I do. What was your easiest course? Your best, most, your favorite course? Uh, favorite. At this point, I don't know. <laughs> you, have, you, have, you, have, you have, you have, I don't have any particular course that I really like. I seem to like have a thing for all of them. And I think that's why it's a bit difficult for me to choose a special now. But do you have any least favorite? Least favorite? Um, maybe philosophy. <laughs> Well, I think all medical professors are actually doing this, including biochemistry. And how did COVID-19 affect your digestion? This is the first time I've seen. I've been here six years, and this is the first time I've seen graduation outside of the university. And the director was very mad today and hand it up to me. So, so how do you make it for I just, I feel very good because at first, we thought that the graduation ceremony will not hold. And we were so sad. But then when we heard that it's going to hold for outside, I was very happy. So I am so grateful they had okay. even with COVID. Corona, you look cute. Do you have any advice for me and the younger people and the older people younger than you? Uh, okay, I, I, this is my simple advice. Just do it. Find what works for you. When it comes to medical school, there is no one way of doing it right or doing it wrong. In order for you to succeed, you need to understand what works for you and then apply it. And then find a group of friends who could be family to you because you need all the support you can get. Someday you will come back from the hospital and you are so down because of the things you see. When the things you saw there and 
Yeah. Who would you look like? And then the social. Oh my god. Join <laughs> school activity. Social yes. school activity. Very, very important. important. Join concerts. Do everything in the faculty. Mm. Very good. Alright, thank you. Thank you so much. I wish you the best. Hello. Hello. Hey. I ask you, how has the medical university experience been for you in one word? Уважаемые родители, поближе становитесь к вашему выпускнику, в принципе, становитесь, соблюдая социальную дистанцию. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy is 
not hard. It's not hard. It's just that it's easy for you to misuse this opportunity of it not being hard. Meaning that if you, miss, if you, if you consistently miss classes, you will find out that it's extremely difficult for you. But if you actually just do the, the minimal, like attend the classes, try to at least, even if it's one question for every class, but like even if it's just to listen to the teacher. So what I decided to tell myself was that uh, every single class, even if it's like one question that the guy said, I understood. Because it's easy to get high scores. You might need it. Trust me, your transcript matters. Like the scores you get in your satchel. So, especially if you're looking into higher education, like masters and PhD, don't look down. What we used to say then is, Shebi, you get four. It's not doctor to get four. She did. Uh, no, 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 no. It will, it, you will realize the value when you need to present your transcript to any higher institution. So it actually matters.